Wow, we might need to build a bus depot on that highway. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> that traffic's getting a little insane. Have you seen my latest Desert Strike video? Or no? I don't think so, no. The one I put on today. You have to rescue the American Embassy mm. in a school bus. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. There's just, there's just, I'm like, there's a school bus? It's so funny. Oh, that power line's That's like not going anywhere. Wait a minute, what? <laughs> I was looking at it, I just leaned forward, I was like, wait a minute, that's going into a brick wall. Apparently new power source, stones. <laughs> stones, they're pretty good at supplying power. Yeah, it's the, the, it sucks the electrons out of the rock. <laughs> rock even have electrons. I know technically it's matter it does, but I don't think it charges really well. I don't remember. <laughs> you know what's stupid? I've been out of school like how long? Just a couple, like a month and a, a couple months. I feel like already my brain is like this. <laughs> I've forgotten everything. <laughs> yeah, I'm one of those guys who forgets things really quickly, but I remember them really quickly once I start doing it. Yeah, we need another fire station. <coughs> Excuse me. Choking to death here. Hmm. Where to put fire station? I know you're right in the middle of construction. <laughs> Your project got cancelled permanently. <laughs> yeah. Careful, because our house isn't powered now. Mm -hmm. A minor inconvenience. A minor and brief. Uh, Talking like Yuri from Command and Conquer, apparently. <laughs> minor setback. Played by... Oh, who is that guy? He's done a lot of horror movies, that guy. I forget who it was. I don't remember. He was a pretty famous horror actor, though. Oh, things, it looks like everything's in the positive again, so that's good. Mm -hmm. Looks like things are growing well, we're making money. I wonder when they're going to want a seaport. That's also my next biggest concern. What else did you have in mind to say, I guess? I don't know, cut back funding so we can raise taxes? <laughs> Ugh, that guy. Good thing he's not there. <laughs> I'm amazed we have not had a disaster yet. We were actually kind of lucky. Yeah. I remember one guy was playing in his power plant caught on fire in like year 10. Oh yeah, we're we're gonna... We need to keep it on this place. Mm. We have two more years. Ooh, we might have to take a bond out. I hope not. We don't have to bulldoze it. It'll blow up on something. Mm. Will it do any damage? No. no, no. Gas no power problem. actually is cheaper. But it's only 50 megawatts, though. Oh, oh yeah. So, it, per megawatt is actually not good at all. It's a good stopgap measure, though. Uh-huh. But I think we'll be low on power if we put it in there. I'd like to save up for oil if we can, maybe. I don't, I don't want to take out a bond, though. Because that'll be hard to pay back. Ugh, hopefully we can save up money. People, start flooding into our city. What's wrong with you? Try rezoning more so we get more people and we can make a mass influx of money before we can do it, before we do our power plant. Bye bye. <laughs> Just starting to bulldoze him. I was gonna lay a bunch of bus depots to Oh hey! It's <laughs> You are not authorized to build there. I revoke your building. Apparently, it's still a green zone, though. Oh yeah, warning. Yeah, she's gonna blow. I don't know why it shows a guy being arrested there. I always wanted that. <laughs> she's gonna blow. This dude being arrested. What is he sabotaging our plant? I never understood he, uh, that. He's running a power plant without a safety certificate, I guess. What is Mother Russia? <laughs> <I don't... laughs> Chernobyl? 
Put it, you can make that res zone a little thicker too. Make it like six thick. Which one? The one you just placed. Thicken it out. Make it three more thickness, remember? Mm -hmm. Just gotta get a road around it. At least everything's different. I'll be merciful and, well, I'll destroy this abandoned. But I'll be merciful this time and leave those in. <laughs> Unless they become abandoned. Then you're down bar. Mm -hmm. Probably put some more industry somewhere, too. Like I said, I'm very gun shy with commercial early game because it's so finicky. Like, you put one too many commercial zones and it just dips in demand really mm. fast. It's very finicky like that. They're making 500 a year. They're doing okay. What are the bond values like? You might have to take one. Oh. <laughs> I think we might have to go to gas power. <laughs> That's too expensive. Yeah, yeah, teen She's workers. She's gonna blow, yet somebody got arrested. It's because Yemen closes his borders, but he tried to cross it. I don't know. <laughs> it always shows that when it says she's gonna blow, though. I don't understand that. Upset market hole. Oh, market. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Market hole. Upset market hole. Crime is becoming a problem. Great. <laughs> How's pollution in Canuckville? Iso Glot says, I don't mind them. They're what make Canuckville the good town it is. Saddam Rubicek. Saddam? <laughs> okay. Yesterday at school, all our PE classes were cancelled because of smog. the smuggler. I guess that says it. Fred Irving. It's ugly and it smells awful. Lena Thomas. The worst part is the graffiti. Everywhere you look, rude slogans of crudely drawn frogs. <laughs> Kelly Bremer. My grandpa is having a terrible time with his lungs. If things don't get better, we will have to move. Susie Carroll. I have not had one good health care experience in Canuckville. What are you talking about? There's hospitals everywhere, son. I thought it was glitching out. <laughs> well, we gotta find out where crime is. Actually, I wouldn't even spend it. We need to save as much money as we can. I would actually argue maybe up. Not so bad. Just gotta build one up there so when we get the chance. I'd actually argue upping taxes a little bit just till we get a power plant. Put it to about 9%. That mean everything to 9. <laughs> but turn it down very quickly. I think you have to check it because I think it fin gets finicky. Then check it again when you get a chance. Because I think the commercial is gonna stay low. Yeah, put it all to nine. Or the industrial, yeah. The industry. There we go. So everyone will be equally uh, taxed. <laughs> mm -hmm. Equally screwed over. That's what we're all about in Canada. We equally screw everyone over. <laughs> eh? Eh? <laughs> I think those houses near the waterfront have no road to them. <laughs> those two houses there? Or... Yeah. How did they get in there? <laughs> I guess walk behind the apartment building. Yeah. Do you make this game more complicated if you had to worry about parking? Oh, <laughs> uh, I, See, I would enjoy that. I like games that are challenging like that. Mm -hmm. That's funny. So you had to be careful how you place the roads. Oh, nice one right there. Raise, raise taxes. Are you serious? Is it 9%? Except the citizens, because it's smoggy and all that. Time running out. Yeah, yeah, we know. Power plant's gonna blow. Well, it just did. <gasps> okay. I'm like, don't tell me it's gonna be a fire. Looks like gas it is. <laughs> Should be enough to provide power until, you know, nope. this thing blows. Power plant needed. Well, then I'll... <sniffs> Not that that would help. No. We probably have to take out a bond. Ugh. Ugh. Show bond percentage. 
Oh well, we have to. There's not much choice we have.